We welcome you inside Chase Center for some late night basketball. It is Jetty Osmond who gets the start tonight. There's Juan Toscano Anderson, a two-way player, second year man out of Marquette to take the tip at 6-6 against the 6-11 Jared Allen. The Cavaliers win the tip and we are underway. John Michael Austin Carr and Angel Gray as here's Jared Allen, now Jetty Osmond. Cavs are the second to last team to visit this building, which opened last season as Allen misfires on an 18-footer. Go ahead, partner. Cavs want to make sure that they stay in contact with this team. They don't want it to get behind early against this team because they will really pass you to death if, you, if that happens. Jared Allen alters a shot at the rim by Draymond Green. Often a hesitation move on Curry will deal off to Isaac Okoro. Cavaliers, as you see, they were in action last night. I mean, and, and, and if you watch how they do it, it's just so good, so much good basketball. I just love watching them play uh, uh, the game because it curls to the corner and the Cavaliers set up shot. Osmond, nearly four minutes in, chased by Curry, pulls up. Allen rebounds and Allen dunks. And allen got the shot inside. Coro went to the high post, worked from there. Curry contested three, rebounded by Osmond as Sexton was out there to get a hand up. Nearly five minutes in, Osmond to the baseline, finds a Coro. Corner three for the tie. Gord. Oubre works on a Coro up through the rookie, missed the shot badly, rebounded by Jetty Osmond, who got the start tonight. Here tonight, lob pass inside. Eventually, it ends up in the hands of Mulder. Mulder wheels one inside to Oubre, who misses from point blank range, is rebounded by Allen. Cavs are getting one shot, giving them one shot. Good, solid defensive efforts. Nine available players tonight for the Cavs. Ten for the Warriors as that pass intended for Allen's knocked away. Comes back to Okoro off to Osman who drills the three and gives the Cavaliers the lead. A good opportunity now. The Cavs moving around, both ends of the floor, moving bodies, moving the ball, and defensively being aggressive. Osman takes it away from Steph Curry. Here comes Lamar Stevens, the rookie out of Penn State, goes all the way. Yep, attacking him on defense. Turning that defense into offense, that's who the Cavaliers are when they're at their best. Pressure by Osmond, deals to Green. The Cavs leave him out there. Green tried to force one inside back to Mulder. That was knocked away by Allen. Nobody was anywhere near Draymond, and he would not attempt the shot. Osmond, another three. Jetty doing a good job of getting off to a good start. He's got a little heat check and went in that time. Jetty Osmond has opened up this ball game with a couple of three-point makes. Yeah, opportunity to, again, keep the defense running. The defensive guy was coming to him. He had a chance to read him that time, get himself set, and knock it down. Jetty got the start with Torian Prince out with left ankle soreness. The Cavs tonight are also missing Dylan Windler out with left knee soreness. Osmond, Garland, Stevens, McGee, and Dotson. Osman with his dribble, looking for somewhere to go. He'll take the mid-range jumper instead. Threw it away, saved by Curry. Bothered by Sexton. Curry, another step back three. That one's short. Osman's on the run. Jetty curls. I like the speed of coming across the timeline with that effort. McGee back to Osman. Zips one up top to Sexton. Now Dotson fakes the three, takes the three. McGee, we said rebound again. He used that length. He's tied this game. <laughs> that duo started at the four and five. Lee from the corner missed it. Osmond, three seconds left. Jetty on the run. Dotson. That shot is blocked. And the first quarter is over. But it's somebody else's man. It, 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 you, if you're the closest man to him, you take him. Steph Curry has re-entered. So has Kelly Oubre. Nobody picks up Osmond. Rebounded by Okoro. Okoro puts it up. That doesn't go. Tapped and eventually grabbed by Garland, who arrives on the scene. Garland creeps baseline, slings one to Sexton. The Cavaliers reset. They have six with which to work. Sexton in a phone booth finds Osmond. Back to Okoro. Three on the way. Foot floor finds Curry. Curry wants to shoot it. Missed the shot. Rebounded by Osmond. Cavs doing a good job of defending in space. Osmond, a hesitation move. Sexton left baseline. Got it. They give a little extra pass to the next to the next guy and Curry knocks it down. 
Osling is run off the line by Bazemore. His floater doesn't go. Allen corrals the loose ball. Hook yes. scores. Good hustle inside by the big fella. Garland, hesitation move. Looking for Allen. Off the window it goes. Allen took some contact. He wanted a foul called. The first half, however, I should say, is over. Allen, 11 points and 8 rebounds. Darius Garland, 12 points. Colin Sexton with 10. Handoff and Draymond down the lane. It works every time, that fake handoff, especially if Steph is coming off. Now, we had this happen in the Brooklyn game. Wiggins and <laughs> the ricochet through Oubre's hands. And Jetty Osman, I just yeah. like the way he runs the floor. Steph Curry, another Draymond screen, and this one over everything. Well, look at Jetty Osmond. I, I just, this guy, he, I don't know if he's a starter on a good team, but as a slasher and a runner and knowing his game, it's pretty smooth. And after he got by his defender there, he made sure he slowed down, let him run to his back as they tried to lob pass. Obviously, Draymond not able to make the Warriors pay, but the rebound all the way out to Sexton. Eddie Osmond's got double figures, but missing that three. Jared Allen the rebound. Talking about it. Yeah, I did it like that. The English. And Draymond, 12 assists. I want him to get 16 tonight. Is that a career high? Well, if you're his teammates, keep back on his Sexton knocks down the three ball. Like, it's deflected twice. He just caught it like it was nothing. Oubre thought he got enough contact there. Didn't get to the line. Yeah, Osmond went straight up. Discipline. I like that no call. Eddie Osmond He'll drop in the three. Think of Osmond's game here as he's got 15 on 6 of 11 shooting, 9 rebounds. He's keeping them in it. 3 of 5 on threes, 12 of 16 shooting. Yeah, he, well, he set the tone going to the basket. That yeah. was against Jared Allen. He figured out a way to get that up. Oubre, in. nice steal. And then Osmond will foul Draymond to stop the break. Allen. Shot clock at 7. Jetty Osmond, the bailout three. The Warrior defense is really clamping down. He's got six points, seven boards, 15 assists, and phenomenal defense. Of course. And that was nearly going to be a steal. It results in a foul. But you can help off that if you have a non-shooter and just try to make it tough. And, and he knows that Osmond is going right now. And he's the guy that's been trying to keep him there. The Warriors just had this big burst offensively to extend the lead back out but Osmond has had a nice game so all hands on deck with him pass away in the corner that's the strong side yeah wherever the ball is is the strong side yeah Kelly Oubre catch and shoot three mm -hmm. Steph fighting in there for the rebound and Osmond touched it last how about Curry on the offensive glass yeah, just trying to give them a taste of their own medicine for his size I thought he was going to flex on that one but he's fighting with Osmond and he's pumped up, man. Uh, don't underestimate the baby-faced assassin. Mulder three. So they're so unselfish. They're setting screens for each other. That was a Juan Toscano screen. Draymond's like, give me Jetty Osmond for a second. And Oubre will foul Garland on the drive. Four Warriors and double figures. He'll get back into his zone. Marlon and Sexton, Jenny Osmond of Coro, and Jared Allen. These are the Cavs starters. And Jenny Osmond missed court to me. I, defensively, it's, it's going to be an issue at times, but there's, there's really a ton of teams that have guards that like to post up nowadays. But you just got to think about them getting healthy again with Kevin Love to figure out what kind of team this really is. Oh, Sexton, though, he's... Oh, no, Osmond. They've had some lazy passes in the fourth here. And that's Sexton pulling that rebound down and drawing a foul. And just think of that sequence where threes you get. 15 of 31 on threes. Hoops for kids getting paid off tonight. Oh, my goodness. Wanamaker back to win. That's one for the, that's one for the highlight reel. Uh, Colin Sexton just sold out for this one. <laughs> And Andrew Wiggins. So I'm looking forward to that Charlotte game. If your LaMelo ball, LaMelo ball intrigues you, you're going to get to see him twice in a week. Yeah, he is showtime. <laughs> some of the plays he makes, some of the passes he makes. Well, Terry Rozier is playing well, too. Yeah, Terry's a problem. Scary Terry, they call him there. They've kind of got their identity back.
Why, why do guys get Boston nicknames? We'll stay in, but Bazemore, Pascal, Damian Lee, Wanamaker, and Molders.